Here we are, everyone. Hardcore Season 5 has officially begun. With a new update, we're starting a new season of Hardcore. And, well, let's just say things are working differently this season. But you'll see what I'm talking about when the video starts. Because I know what some of you guys are thinking. Wait, Grozzy, what about Hardcore Season 4? Did you die in the world? No, Hardcore Season 4 is actually not ending. It's getting renamed and, well, I'm not going to waste time explaining it here. If you want to see me explain it all and what's going on in detail, go watch this video and you'll understand what's going on with the double seasons after you watch that. But no more wasting your time. Let's get started. Oh my god, I'm so excited. So, we have a few, uh, we have a few changes to what's happening and how we're going to do things. So in the past seasons, I didn't share with you guys the seed. But this time, I'm sharing with you. I'm sharing the seed with you. I did some seed scouting because I wanted to find a good seed with like mountains. Because obviously, I want to do stuff with the new mountains. I looked around with some seeds, and eventually, I came across one. So uh, these are seeds I was looking through. Create new world, hardcore season five. I cannot believe I'm actually doing this. We're here. So, I believe, if memory serves right, the seed should be... That. <laughs> that should be the seed. Create new world. Oh god, here we go. This should be the right world. I don't know if capitalization was exactly right. It should be. I'll be able to tell immediately based on the spawn. I kind of hope it's the wrong... I'm resetting it. No, it's the right seed. It's the right seed. Here we are. Oh yeah, one quick thing I forgot to mention. I'm only ever playing in this world live on stream. So there will be no playing off stream. So all the footage you're going to be seeing is taken directly from my live streams right here on my YouTube channel. You can view the last live streams in the past live streams playlist here on my YouTube channel. And if you want to catch future streams, be sure to subscribe with notifications on. I should be creating a stream schedule soon. So look out for that. The season five world. Uh, pretty, pretty bland spawn. I'm not going to lie. But it gets better as we go. Um, I didn't actually look around spawn. I just immediately teleported to the mountain biome. So we can have a look around and see if there's like some mine shafts on the, on the surface. And we can like get some some early golden apples or something. I don't know. Um, there's a village. Again, I don't I don't know what's around spawn. I TP'd straight to the mountains. And I want to kill those sheep so that we have a bed. I do not want to go through the night. So, I guess we'll go check out the village. Maybe they have hay bales for some early food. But I want to get uh, these sheep that were down here first. Coal does not spawn below zero, so stock up before you go down. That's actually a really good tip. Thank you. Keep that in mind. I'll keep that in mind. Cave base? Probably, it's going to be mountain stuff. I want to do some builds with the caves as well. But, I there's some... I won't spoil anything. It'll speak for itself when you see it. It's really cool. It, it's really, really cool. But yeah, we're gonna have to travel quite a ways to get to this new spot. Uh, it's it's not like incredibly far away, but it's not like just out of render distance, you know. Ooh, there's more hay bales. I want to try and find a red bed because you can't use you can't use any other color. Why red bed? Because red bed's the OG. Having any other color for a bed makes me just feel wrong. Because I don't know how many, how long some of you guys have been playing, but back in the day, there was no colored beds. It was just red by default. After gathering some supplies for the village, I started to make my way towards the mountain biomes. You see, when I was scouting out this seed, trying to figure out what was in it, the only thing I was looking for was mountain biomes. I knew nothing else about the world apart from the mountain biomes I was going to. I wanted to set up my main base in these mountain biomes, so I had to travel quite a distance to get there. So I began the journey heading southeast. Or at least, that's the direction I thought I was heading in. Where's the area I'm going? It's gotta be over here somewhere. I thought, I thought this direction was north for some reason, so I was going in the wrong direction. And just when I thought it couldn't get any worse. This is not a good omen for how the series is going to go. Why is there a zombie? Nice. We're murderers. There's another one. Where are they? Where are they spawning? Why are they spawning? The light level's 15. Why are they spawning? So I waited like months to get a thunderstorm in Hardcore Season 4. We just got one on literally day one. Witch. There's a freaking witch. Please, bro. This isn't fair. Wait, it's a thunderstorm. I can sleep. Let's go. Nevertheless, I resumed my journey heading in the actual right direction, finding some pretty neat stuff along the way.
Oh, there's an azalea tree right there. Are you serious? There's another one. And finally, the mountains came into view. Oh, here we are. We made it. We made it. This isn't the cool area yet. There's still a ways to go. But this is part of the area we're going to be building at. Just wait. Just wait. No, no, it gets cooler. Don't, don't let out your woes and wows because it gets even cooler. All right, now we're starting to get into the cool area. You can see it loading in. Oh, yep, you can see it. <laughs> it gets better, trust me. It keeps getting better. Just wait. You guys are saying, wow, and holy. That's so crazy. But it just... It gets better, okay? It, it, it gets better. Yeah, it... It's pretty cool. Uh, yeah, this is, uh... It's still just the start, trust me. It's still just the start. Alright, I'm gonna... Hopefully my FPS does not tank. I can imagine, like, bridges between the mountains. That is exactly what I thought. Believe it or not, the thumbnail for this stream is actually this location. So if you want to see, like, a full wide shot, just look at the thumbnail. But yeah, I'm imagining, like, a castle in this valley. A city. And then, like... Towers and buildings sprawling across the mountaintops. Like, imagine a giant tower on, like, each of these little peaks. And then, like, thin rope bridges connecting them. They're, like, drooping way down. We can climb this mountain a bit. Or, no, let's go climb this mountain. Because this mountain has something cool up atop. So, yeah, now you're starting to see why I chose this world. But, yeah, there's some other cool things outside of these mountains that I'm going to show you. And a, maybe a potential spot for where we're going to make our actual starting home. Because there's something... Something cool. I'm sure you noticed way over that way on the other side of this mountain, there was a pillager outpost. So maybe like that mountain is like the outcasts of the city who were like banished from the community. So they went off onto the mountain and they made their own home. Right? Right? Okay, there's nothing. Here we go. Here we go. Look at this. There's just like a dip in the mountains up here. Imagine like a big old temple or a monument or even like a castle here. A broken castle that got destroyed by a meteor. That's an, that's a pretty good idea. That's a pretty cool idea. There's That's a lot of goats. Jeez. I don't actually think I want to go near them because they're just going to bunt me off the mountain. Let's loop back over to where the village was so I can show you that. He's going to die from powdered snow, isn't he? No, I can spot the powdered snow. Don't clip that because then when it happens, I don't want to have to look at this clip again. So the area I'm thinking about making a starter base of sorts is really really cool you're gonna see what i mean when i go up there but again i want to go over to the like area behind me more from the looks of it there's i haven't like seen powdered snow on this mountain yet but again it's not that difficult to spot because it has like a it doesn't have the lighting like you see there's the shadows on the side of the block in the corners powdered snow does not have that so it's quite easy to see yeah that's powder snow. see see there's no shadows you see that so that's powdered snow. Okay, now I'm careful. Now I'm going to be careful because there's, there's powdered snow. See? That's powdered snow. You can tell because of the difference in the texture. There's actually a bit of... There's a lot of powdered snow. I don't know if I want to walk through here. Oh, there's emerald? I don't think we can mine it with a stone pickaxe. I think it's iron you need. But we do have a blast furnace. We could quickly make an iron pick. Ooh, I don't have enough wood for this. I have bamboo. I can make six of bamboo. Yeah, and then we still have one we can plant. Sword shovel and then we'll do axe so we'll just make armor for now we'll make leggings chest plate make boots uh helmet i don't remember what's oh there's an igloo i can't tell if it has i don't think it has an basement i don't know am i giving you guys anxiety by the way by doing this And I hit every single one of them. Okay. Which mountain am I supposed to be going to? I think that that's the one. That's the mountain I'm going to. I'll show you. You guys will see. This, I think, is where I want to maybe make my spawn base. And here we are at where I think I want to build my, my first little village. Look at this. It's completely surrounded by mountains, and it's just a little valley, and then they go, it's like sheer drop, like here, I'll get over up there, and I'll look down, it looks absolutely insane. See, like, look, it's just sheer drop, look at this mountain, bro, I want to climb up it. 
playing <laughs> playing life on the edge. Jesus. Okay, I shouldn't be doing this. What about this? You guys know you guys like that? You guys you guys scared? I don't want to ruin the pristine look of the mountain. Should I try Neo this? Should I, should I Neo it? <laughs> I hope you guys aren't scared. Ooh! I should not be doing this. But I'm doing it anyways. Let's go. <laughs> Look at that. Look at this little valley. And we could have like a secret tunnel. It could be like a secret valley. And there's like a tunnel that goes through down into the forest there. And it's like a secret tunnel to get into the to the to the valley. It could be like a, a magical kind of like uh Shang-Chi, if you guys watched that new movie. It's like I forget what the place is called, but there's like the other kind of dimensional world where uh Shang-Chi's mother came from. Kind of like that. It's like a secret magical village. I instantly thought of making a huge glass dome to cover the sky. That could be cool. But I don't know if I wanna because my idea is to have like a very close, tight, like tightly packed community like civilization across the mountains right and so it's gonna be like medieval style and so i don't want to do anything like that crazy in this area like i want to kind of keep it medieval style like i don't know i don't know how to explain it after setting up some of my things in the valley i decided to go for my first caving trip it took a bit of exploring but we finally found a good cave to explore nice big cave oh, okay there's a giant hole is it dripstone, though? It doesn't look like it. This looks like a regular old cave. Well, not. it's obviously not regular. It's massive, but it's not dripstone. So that's, like, the main idea. I don't exactly know. Okay, that was epic. I'm waiting for a creeper to fall on my head and kill me. I should stick to the edges. Okay. Okay. Music disc, let's go. Another music disc, let's go. Iron horse armor, I guess that's cool. Take the redstone. I, saw, I hear you, zombie. Could there be another dungeon? That could be cool. We already found a double dungeon. Oh, hello, sirs. There is another! Are you serious? Let's go. So, can we activate them both at once? That's the question. Oh my god, there's like a two block difference. Oh, it's more like five. But I mean, almost. Almost. Please don't fall on my head, creeper, please. Oh, there's diamonds right there. How did I miss that? I literally walked right over them. Here we go. Please don't be one. All right, we continue mining. All right, is there... That is what I'm worried about. Imagine if I was standing there and they dropped directly on top of me. Okay. Okay. We'll take the lead. Uh, we already have cat. All right, let's see. Is it going to be another one vein? We found two one veins already. I swear to f***ing god, I'm gonna lose it. I'm gonna lose it, bro. It could be- Oh, there's more here! Let's go. I knew I should have double-checked. Is that another dungeon? Are you serious? What do you mean? That's like, what, five? Wait, four? Oh, we just ran into a geode. Okay, well, it's good to know this is here. Wait, there's diamonds right here. What the heck? It's another one vein. Diamonds are so much harder to find now. They're like emeralds, except they're not as common. Oh, I can make that. 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 First try, let's go. Or rather... Rain. That's powder snow! <laughs> Let's not do that again. Okay. There's no right there. Jesus, I need to pay attention. Okay. Okay. 
Let's uh be more careful in the future. Do I see one? <gasps> Powder snow! We're fine. Alright, uh, this should be good. We could go check out our nether, actually. Looks like there's a lava pool right there. Ah! And break these two. Here we go. Okay, what have we got? Oh, God. I don't see any, like, structures or anything. It's kind of a safe location for the portal, so I like that. But that's not where our main nether portal is going to connect up to, obviously. Because we're going to make ours in the, uh, the secret village. All right, I don't like this, though, so we're going to go back. Yay, we did it. We explored the nether. So we're going to be building up our starter base here. But, uh, there's a lot of materials we need. We need stuff from lush caves. We need concrete powder. All sorts of stuff. There's all kinds of things we need. As you heard me say, I needed a lot of materials for this build. And I needed pretty much every single block that spawns in a lush cave. So I backtracked to the azalea trees that I saw on the way to the mountain biomes and dug beneath them to get to a lush cave. Okay, so this is absolutely crazy by the looks of things. Oh. My. God. Do not look at that enderman. There's a geode. Four blossom. Okay, we need... S the main things we need, we need like... We need literally everything but drip leaf from here. Axolotl! <gasps> Friend? Friend? Amigo? Amigo? I'll save you. Alright, we need names. We need names immediately. Call it Ned... I don't know. Ned is an interesting name for an axolotl. Hello, sir. Hello. No! Friend! Oh, shit! Um... <laughs> We, we, we just sacrificed, we just sacrificed him to save our life. Jesus. All right, well, there's another one. You killed, you killed Ned. You killed him. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. We just witnessed a crime. I'll kill all of you. <laughs> Poor Ned. Uh. He will live on in our hearts. <laughs> the first axolotl's already dead. Maybe I shouldn't own pets. <laughs> we'll find another one. We'll find another. <laughs> the poor guy. <laughs> I kidnapped him and he immediately died. <laughs> oh, God. And there's something in my eye. You know what it is? It's a tear for our fallen soldier. In my defense, I didn't want to die, so I had to sacrifice Ned. I don't know if I would have... I could have shielded, I guess, but I really don't trust shields. <gasps> New friend! Okay, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna get a new bucket. He's yellow, right? Yeah. Okay, we have a new friend. Alright, we gotta come up with a serious name for this one. I like the name Butterscotch. Because he's golden. And I thought butter at first, but I was like, butter's too basic. I feel like I should- Ooh! Diamonds? Let's go! Petition for Yellow Ned? No, we're not naming it Yellow Ned. Why does everyone want that? I was looking for like- a cute name for a cute boy, but everyone just wants Yellow Ned. <laughs> oh, there's a Spore Blossom. And Diamonds, let's go. Just one. Two. What? We got more than a one vein? <gasps> Three. Excuse me. You guys really want to name our first Axel. Instead of having, like, wholesome, like, cute Axolotl friend, which just Yellow Ned. Wait, I heard an Axolotl. Friend? There's a brown one. Do we take more? Should we get... I mean, I guess we should get some more to breed. No, we're not naming of different iterations of Ned. We are not doing that. Before you suggested, it's not happening. Don't even bother saying that in chat. No, no, I... No. <laughs> it's not brown Ned and pink Ned. That's not what we're naming these guys. That's not happening. No, stop. All shall be named Ned. 
God. You guys are really creative. I like this. All right, should we turn on shaders? <laughs> the ores glow? Holy... Oh my god. And my PC isn't even going crazy. There's lava over there. This is incredible. Wow. It's kind of cheating though, because I can just see ores from like millions of miles away. Excuse me? Okay, that was epic. I'm pretty, pretty awesome. Believe it or not, but between all of the Ned shenanigans with the axolotls, I was actually collecting all the moss and pretty much everything I needed from the biome. But the Ned jokes did not end there. It's like the infinity, the infinity Ned. <laughs> you have to collect the infinity Neds. We're not collecting the infinity Neds. It's like, okay, so if there's the infinity Neds and I'm Thanos, then the first Ned was Gamora. I'm sorry, little one. They're the Infinity Neds, and I have to collect them all because I'm Thaned. Nedoth. <laughs> and there was a whole bunch of other stuff that happened with- it was unbelievable. It went on for like an hour. So I might make like an own, like its own separate highlight video for just the Ned shenanigans. But I managed to collect the rest of the resources I needed and get started on my starter house. So what I wanted with this house and the entire village actually was a kind of magical feel and I wanted to make it seem like the people of the village were really connected with nature. So for this village and you're going to start to see it on this house, I wanted like moss tendrils and tentacles coming out of the ground, climbing up the mountains, eating away at the homes. You'll get a better idea of what I mean when you see the finished product. I think that looks pretty nice. But I don't know, what do you guys think? We should maybe get some flower pots? Um, but I don't think I really want to go adventuring for clay or anything. Alright, let's look for my way up, way, way up here, and then we'll get a little close. We could turn on shaders. Honest opinions on this, what are our thoughts? Final thoughts before ending. I think I really like it. At first I wasn't sure about the massive tendrils of moss, but I think it's pretty cool. I rated a 9.5 out of 10 due to the terraforming at the back, but that will be done. Yeah, yeah, it'll be done. Definitely. Oh, that is sick. Oh my God. Look at that screenshot right there. That is such a good angle, such a good position of the sun. Oh my God. This is awesome. Wow, I gotta turn it off. My computer fans are going like, like they're really loud. Yeah, I think that's it for me. Maybe a stream on Sunday, although I don't know what time I'll stream Sunday. I'll probably just stream whenever I want. But for next week, we will have a stream schedule. Thank you all for stopping by. And uh, I'll see you guys in uh, the next stream.